welcome back students now in today's session what are we going to learn we are going to learn the Friedel-Crafts alkylation reaction of benzene <coughs> so what is Friedel-Crafts alkylation step by step we will see so here when I have to write the definition we have been writing the definition for all like nitration means introduction of NO2 group sulfonation means introduction of SO3H halogenation means introduction of chlorine group now in Friedel-Crafts alkylation it is basically introduction of alkyl group introduction of alkyl group in which one in benzene ring done in the place of hydrogen in the place of hydrogen atom all right in the place of hydrogen atom it's called friedel crafts alkylation so first of all for friedel crafts alkylation what are the requirements what do you require you are going to or this whole reaction occurs in the presence of a Lewis acid that is your aluminum chloride so you're going to take this Lewis acid in the presence of that only we are going to show the alkylation reaction suppose let us take I'm going to take benzene when I take benzene now I'm going to add Rx what is Rx Rx stands for alkyl halide alkyl halide suppose this is methane so this is R to this methane, I am taking out one hydrogen, I am introducing one more X, then it is Rx, alkyl halide, okay, done. <clears throat> I said we are going to introduce in the presence of aluminium chloride. This H and this X combines and this comes out as HX. What is left out? We are left out with the alkyl group which is attached to benzene ring. So this is R. This is alkyl benzene now. Alkyl benzene. Now let us take example. I am going to take a benzene ring, right? In place of X, I am going to introduce Cl. In place of R, I am going to introduce CH3. Now I am taking aluminium chloride again. The hydrogen which is there in benzene, it comes out as HCl. And CH3, whatever is there, it goes in attacks and it forms a compound called toluene toluene or toluene suppose here instead of chlorine i'm going to take bromine alkyl bromide so this is your benzene i'm going to introduce bromine ch3 this is alkyl bromide so hbr comes out what do we require we require aluminium chloride as a lewis acid but here not you should not use this careful for bromine you are going to use febr3 iron bromide so hbr is out what do i get i get ch3 that is toluene right clear students let us take one more suppose if i take benzene ring if your teacher has given you like this this is what ethyl chloride Whenever you see chlorine, you should be careful, you are going to introduce AlCl3. Whenever you see bromine, you will introduce FeBr3. Now, what will happen? The hydrogen here and this chlorine comes out as HCl. And this whole thing attacks here. So, the ring, CH3. So, this is C, your CH2, this is CH3. Now, come 3 plus 1, 4, 2, 3, 4. So, this is ethyl benzene. This is ethyl chloride. This is benzene. So, all these are called Friel Crafts alkylation reactions. Done. Now, let's come back and see the mechanism of Friel Crafts alkylation reactions. Mechanism. So, first important thing I said this whole reaction occurs in the presence of aluminium chloride. Yes or no? Yes. So, for this, first you are going to take alkyl halide. Count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Minus. Okay. Aluminum chloride here acts as a Lewis acid. Right? Fine. So, it is going to accept this pair of electrons. And how does this look like? R x is here 
because this has lost this pair of electron what will happen it's going to attain a positive charge now and ALCl3 has accepted that pair of electrons now this has a positive charge to satisfy that this bond shifts what do you get I get R plus this is alkyl carbocation alkyl carbocation let me change my pen this is not writing properly okay let me take this now what is left out I left out with this one X ALCl3 now count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 now ALCl3 is minus so alkyl carbocation is ready this has acts as an electrophile now I am going to take the same benzene ring as we have seen step 1 shift when it shifts out how does this look like because this site has lost an electron means up here the shade pit is lost here isn't it so you get a positive charge here and a negative charge at this point now the carbocation whatever is there attacks this is shade to an alkyl group what do you get bond is here when this is shade to the alkyl group hydrogen R now there's a positive charge still existing to satisfy that this pi bond shifts here what do you get you are going to get hydrogen is here r is here one pi bond one pi bond because this has lost the this is donated to this site isn't it so this attains a positive charge electron deficient in the next step the pi bond from here shifts so when this is shifted here you will get a positive charge correct so your bond yeah here here and this is plus this is hydrogen this is alkyl group now further now see here this is over this bond also has shifted from here this has come in this direction this is positive right now suppose I, 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 you can pick up anything you can take this you can take this you can take this any any uh, the part you can take and finally what happens suppose if I take any of the intermediate state when this was in this direction further there is a cleavage of the bond here to satisfy this this bond shifts and there is a cleavage and only alkyl group is present alkyl group and your H plus is out this is your alkyl benzene benzene now basically this H plus whatever is there what happens to this it's going to combine with you have ALCl3 isn't it in the first reaction you've got this ALCl3 here <coughs> that H plus combines with this ALCl3 right so ALCl3 this is minus this H okay there we have cleaved it already let's see yeah X 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 this is shade with this hydrogen now how does this look bond formed ALCl3 also is here now this is shade and electron pair that means this gets a positive charge now further what happens this is a negative charge this bond is shared to yes, the bond is broken this is shade and you get HX outside and ALCl3 so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So the advantage of Friedel-Crafts reaction, what is that, uh, What is the disadvantage of Friedel-Crafts reaction? What happens is, in some cases, the carbocation is formed, right? So what does it do? It starts rearranging to become a more stable carbocation. That only rearranges. Before we introduce that in the benzene ring, it rearranges. So the, the rearranged carbocation, what will happen? It enters the ring instead of the original one. It will enter. And basically we want the carbocation, alkyl uh, uh, isn't it? group to be introduced. <coughs> but the carbocation, because of rearrangement, we get an unexpected product. So let us write that. Disadvantages 
डिसएडवांटेज ऑफ रीडल क्राफ्ट रिएक्शन राइट ओके एंड जस्ट चेंज माई पेन एंड कम बैक टू यू 